we shall proceed with the calculations for the examples that we did previously to estimate the size of the plate girdle. As we have gone through the preliminary estimating, the dimensions of the plate girdle has decided as per given in the figure here. The conditions and the specifications of the members are the same as the previous questions. The question asks us to check for the flank induced buckling and also to check for the moment resistance of the member. You may pause the video for a while for you to work out the solution. To solve these questions, we are going to use back the equations for the flank induced buckling. Initially, when we do preliminary estimations, we assume the ratio of the area of the weight and then the area of the flank for the compression flank is equal to 1. But in real case, it might not necessarily to be equal to 1. So we will adopt the actual value, substitute into the relevant equations. The E is equal to 210 gigapascal and the k is assumed to be 1.4 based on the questions given and the u strength is 355 based on the strength given for the steel and as the thickness is less than 40 there won't be any reduction in terms of the u strength of the member the limit for these equations is calculated here and this limit is to be checked against the actual HW per TW ratio. The actual HW per TW ratio is by obtained by dividing the 1.5 meters with the thickness here. And the actual ratio is less than the limit. That means the flank induced buckling is considered acceptable. Next, we check for the moment resistance of the member. The equations for the moment resistance is given here, which is in the function of the area of the flank, multiply the U strength of the flank, divided by factor of safety and multiply the lever arm here. It is calculated to be equals to 4000 plus. The moment resistance is then compared with the moment loop as per calculated in the previous steps which is this and it is found that the moment resistance is actually higher than the load therefore the moment resistance is considered acceptable